hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here, and this might be the last episode of this. Uh, okay, so we have a boss gate there. A ladder up here. Well, I could use that stuff. Okay. this do? Oh. I guess up was more stuff. Oh, well, okay. Well, time for Robot Master rematches. It is Ringman. Let's see what I've learned on how to deal with these guys. thing. Yeah, he's best dealt with just because there's that long period where you have to dodge all that stuff. Safe bright though. Let's go to Pharaoh Man. Okay, we know his weakness. It's Toad Man. Oh, that Got him. Alright, let's just keep going around here. That was Toad Man. You're weak to dust. Especially when I get up close with it. Dive Man, we did not find your weakness. I could really use your weakness. It's got to be like Pharaoh. It does not have to be a Pharaoh. Uh, it has to be a Ring, then. Yeah. Dive Man was really. It was one of the more difficult robot masters I had. Oh, Drill Man, you're still weak to dive missiles, so let's just do that. Got him. Dustman, we don't know what your weakness is. Probably like Skull Man. I called it. Alright, who else we got? Bright Man. We had your weakness when we fought you either. So you gotta be weak to Pharaoh? Yeah, you have inverted your weakness. Was Pharaoh like pushing him back there? Oh, whatever. I saw him like 
pushing back after he did his teleport thing. Skullman, we didn't have your weakness. It's gotta be Drill. Alright, cool. And last... It is time for Ringman. And I am just... I'm cheesing this one. Ringman is definitely the toughest one, just because of that one big volley when he turns purple and is immune to damage. Hey, it's interesting how he turns the color of... Mega Man when he's using the Bright Idea weapon. And I'm still calling it the Bright Idea. Alright, now we gotta deal with Wily. What do you want to be weak to? Uh, still weak to ring here. I wonder if this form is still going to be weak to drills. Um. He tempted me. Still, how... I don't know what to do against this Wily. It seems like I barely have a chance to hit it. And I'm not a fan of that. Again, I also didn't try just shooting at him. Well, that didn't work. That's not gonna be good. supposed to deal with this. My first form is fine. But opportunities to hit the second form... Seems like they're very few. Idea. My idea. 
magnet is not very good. Okay, that is the idea. Better to just let him not get going on this. That's why the one-up is there, so it shows you that you've got to go far enough to the right to get him to activate. Ah, uh, I don't want to use another E-Tank, but... Actually... I don't have to. Please don't have another phase. I'm not gonna try and rain flush him and see if we can glitch the game like in NES Mega Man 4. Ah, uh, we do have another... Yep, that's right, because in Mega Man 4 we still had a final round. That's a big question mark. Alright, well let's just continue. Let's finish things up here. I don't know what we need. Seems like his weakness was still the same, so... At least the, the last round was still the same, being ring and then drill. So maybe this one will still be weak to Pharaoh. Not expecting this to go on for too long. There's down arrows here. No! I knew something was gonna happen. All right. Yeah, do the spike drop again. It's not that difficult of a spike drop. One up is exactly what I want to be having. Do I have to go down? I don't have to. I want that. I'm not getting it from this angle, though. Okay, well, we're on a completely different path. Uh, we're on a jump golem path again. No, actually, I recognize this. I can't expect me to. Oh! Now we better start following the prescribed path. Oh!
pick up some goodies. I don't know why I filled that up, not something else. Oh, things are getting dark. I don't know if I like this. Yep. In theory, I should fill up. What? Well, that's just a theory. That's just in. That's not as weak as. Get a weakness? Skull barrier? I can get a bunch of things that aren't your weakness. Dust. Okay, dust is his weakness. I just find it odd that the other Wily machines retain their weakness of Ring, Boomerang, and Drill, while this one was changed from Pharaoh to Dust. But okay. Now that we got a weakness, now I can focus on dodging him and killing him. That attack is a little bit insane. Got me too. I hope there isn't another form. And again, I still have four E tanks. Got him. I had to say it. Um, excuse me. What is base here? Okay, I think I can get him. This better be the last form. Got him. Okay, that's the last form. I will say, uh... Probably my only negative point is that there were a lot of bosses in the Wily Castle. Okay. <laughs> uh, there were a lot of bosses in the Wily Castles that uh, had multiple forms. I think in one or two instances that was okay, but I think it was just kind of overdone a little bit. Like the when we had the other clone Mega Man, did we need a second form of that using Block Dropper? I don't think we did. So with his new base of operations destroyed, Dr. Lily's plans... Okay, the world could finally breathe out once again for a while.
Bagman 4, Original Staff. Okay. So, yeah, final review. A very overall positive experience. I did kind of mention this before, but the some of the gimmicks in some of the stages could have used a little bit more fleshing out. I think those dropper enemies that like to carry you into spikes and pits and stuff, I think those were a little bit overused in the Wily stages. Other than that, though, very positive overall design. I love the redesign of all the Robot Masters. I love the, the redesign of the Wily bosses. I think the game was semi on the easier side for the most part, with a few exceptions, those being like the multi form, multi phase bosses. Um. Yeah, I think this changed a lot of stuff from the original Mega Man 4, but made things pretty enjoyable. Rain Flush and Drill Bomb, Drill Bomb especially, just take too much ammo. I can understand with Rain Flush, but why does Drill Bomb have to take so much ammo all of a sudden? Still, it was really fun seeing the Mega Man 4 stages redesigned, reimagined. This is like the quality level of hacks I I would enjoy playing. I know that's not always the case when it comes to hacks and quality and difficulty levels, but uh, this one I started, like I said, I saw one episode of this on Dr. Novocaine's channel. He was playing the red version. And I just decided, you know, this is this seems like it's going to be really good. I don't want to get spoiled on it. I'm going to play the game myself blind, and that is what I did. And now that I'm done, I can go back through and finish watching Dr. Novocaine's playthrough, see some of the differences between the red and blue versions, and um, see maybe where Dr. Novocaine kind of struggled with this game and see if he found something different than what I did. I, I found that Spike Absorber, but uh, I don't know if there was another thing that we ended up missing. I didn't go back through every single stage, just a couple of them, and I, I didn't find much of anything other than some E-Tanks. I also think that one Wily stage they had the Weapons Archive. I love the Weapons Archive, but the stage itself could have used, I don't know, like some more checkpoints or maybe just not as long of stretches. Yeah, various... okay. Overall, though, I would give this game a very solid sort of... We'll give it an A. I, I think it deserves a solid A. I was thinking A- minus for some of the, the minor issues I had, but there's enough things that are super positive for more detailed... Oh, more detailed threads. Um, yeah, I recommend playing this one. else do I have to say about this game that I haven't already said? A lot of the enemy placements were fairly nice. There were a lot of decent challenges, but nothing that was overbearing to the point where I would have to use save states to try and get through it. And this was presented by Retroz. Alright, well there you go. So I guess we're going to put this game to bed. My controller has frozen up here because we're at the end. I think that's just what it does in uh, Mega Man 4. So I guess, yeah, we'll put this game to bed. This has been Late Night Mega. Good night, everybody.